we're going to be watching over the next three, four, or five hours. The water being pushed up from the Gulf and the San Carlos Bay and up the Caloosahatchee River. Already, the dock is underwater. And if you've been watching, just in 15, 20 minutes, the water continues to come up on this little sandy area at the base of the hotel. We're watching the water come up. The surge beginning over about an hour ago. It's come up about three feet. The whole pier and dock now submerged. We're looking out at the Caloosahatchee River, and that rolls into San Carlos Bay, into the Gulf. There's so much water around, so many harbors. Uh, there's water everywhere. The wind's coming right across the Gulf, across Fort Myers Beach, and the bay, and right into the Caloosahatchee River. The surge is coming up. This is going to be our last live shot here because the surge is coming in. We have to get to a higher place and get out of this. We're expecting a surge at least of 12 feet. So that would be put the water over my head. Last check at the weather station across the water. Whoa, 62 gusting to 87 miles an hour. Good afternoon from Fort Myers. And this is the worst of Hurricane Ian. We have come up here for safety from the surge. Look at the wind howling through here. And where we were earlier, it looks like there's three or four feet of water. Waves crashing over the area from this morning. These winds are howling hurricane force plus and gusting over 100 miles an hour. The entire area, everything that's not up 20 feet is underwater right now. And uh, it's just, this is one of the worst hurricanes I've ever been in. And maybe the worst as far as covering over 25 years and 90 storms to be right in the eye wall of a high-end Cat 4. And the wind, just listen to the, let's just listen to the wind. We're standing up here on the balcony and yeah, it's 10 or 15 miles an hour. So we're in a perfect position to get out of the wind and avoid the debris.